Chris in Boise. In this video, we're actually working on prepping an exterior of a small home. And as you can see over here, the siding after power washing has a lot of the paint that actually has come off. And it's not an actual wood siding, it's just um, a wood material. It's basically just a glorified cardboard siding, is what it is. And where all this, this um, missing paint is, where it's all come off, we're actually going around and we're wire brushing it and using medium sanding sponges. And to get all the loose paint off, just going along here, wire brushing the bottoms of them, and then we're going back and sanding all this with our, just like that with our medium sanding sponges to smooth it out, make sure it's not all fuzzy. And then we've got primer, and we're using Sherwin Williams Super Paint, and we're using an 18-inch nap to just go in and back roll over all this this siding to actually push the paint in and get it in all the the fuzzy siding this actually looks like cardboard and we're just back rolling this whole thing and we need to go through this process to get our top coat to actually stick and adhere really well and it'll look a lot better if you wire brush it sand it and back roll it prior to actually painting it once we paint it then we're going to spray two coats of paint over it and then we got our peel bond down here, XIM peel bond. We're using peel bond. We've got a lot of peeling paint on the corner boards, and we're using the peel bond to hand brush all the corner boards and all the window trim with that peel bond. And peel bond is a primer that can go right over the bare wood. two hours into painting this house and we've got the front of it already sprayed, masked off, garage door different color. We're working our way around the other side. All the masking is complete. I've sprayed the front of it. Now, now Finished spraying the front, two sides. We got one guy working on fascia. We're getting ready to mass spray the door. We've already started spraying the shutters, and these were brand new shutters, so we had to drill holes to install the shutters with shutter buttons. And we're working our way around doing the fascia and trim. Fascia is being done on the other side. Gommel's on the roof, that side's been sprayed. He's up there doing fascia. We've now completed the shutter's doors. We've reinstalled the shutter front door. We've gone around with the second coat on the fascia and trim. We're working around the trim on the backyard. And we just sprayed their Adirondack chair to match the front trim. Also, we're working our way on the back side, doing first coat and second coat on the back. And the it's back. now almost four o'clock, and we're five and a half hours into this job with four colors. And we've sprayed their chair, got it installed. The shutters now, front door is back up, painted. We've been begun installing downspouts, 
and second coating the face and trim in the back. You got Gamo up here doing down spouts or doing fascia and we're actually working our way around the back. Everything's sprayed. Everything's done up front. We're also working on the deck and back. Eric's going around doing the cut-ins and the deck in the back at this point in time too now. The front is just about done. We've now painted the roof jacks, roof vents, and we've got all everything painted up front, two coats, chairs back up, work around the back side, and back side's getting completed. It is now 5.30. We started this project at 10.30, so we're into it seven hours, and it's a 1,200 square foot home. Finished trimming out the last door. All the trim's done, been two coated, other than this last door right here. Got almost trimming that door out. Eric is finishing up the deck. He's coating the deck with Sherwin Williams deck scapes. And that's the second coat he's actually putting on the deck now. The back has been all completed, all the trim. Everything's been trimmed out. The deck's looking pretty nice. After this deck is done, after Gamo finishes up that last door, just gotta clean up our brushes and rollers, and that'll be a seven and a half hour project. Four colors, 1,200 square feet. The house is now complete. Exterior. Just putting up a couple drop cloths. That's it. Done for the day. Another exterior done. Third one for 2012.